Hi, I'm Dr. Stan Kucher, and I would like to take a few minutes of your time to tell you about an incredibly exciting, very effective project that we are currently working on in the countries of Malawi and Tanzania and Sub-Saharan Africa in partnership with Farm Radio International and Farm Radio Trust. Now you say, what is a farm radio doing working with us? And the answer is, we are putting together, I have put together, a project that integrates radio drama, integrates school-based mental health literacy with teacher training in our own Canadian guide adapted for use in Africa, added to that radio listening clubs and peer mental health educators and with the training for the first time ever of community health care workers in being able to identify, diagnose and effectively treat young people with depression. So what we have done in these two very low income countries is integrate mental health awareness with mental health literacy at the community level through radio dramas and interactive electronic communication between young people, radio stations and mental health experts. We have been able to increase the mental health literacy of teachers and students, improving their knowledge, decreasing stigma, enhancing the ability of teachers to identify young people with depression and enhancing the ability of young people to identify themselves and their peers and to get the skills that they need to help themselves get well. And we have created pathways to care, linking schools to community health clinics and have trained community health care providers who have never before been able to identify, diagnose, and effectively treat young people with depression, to actually do that, and to do that well. And the outcomes are great. So, actually, that took us three years. That's all. Just three years. And we have studied every step of the way. Randomized cohort studies of the impact of the radio on young people who live in communities that have no running water or mostly no electricity. Tremendously positive impact. Impact in schools where they have never ever studied or even heard about mental health and mental illnesses except for the stigmas around psychosis. Huge differences for teachers and students alike. And the creation of capacity in the community health care system not expensively, very inexpensively, by training community health care workers to identify, diagnose, and treat young people, and having schools linked directly to community health centers to help young people. We are thrilled to have been part of working on this really innovative approach to improving youth mental health care, specifically depression. We are also thrilled to be part of the World Bank, World Health Organization Innovation Fair being held in Washington this April. One of only a very few projects selected from across the world to identify new ways, unique directions for improving the health and mental health of young people globally. It's been a great pleasure to have our group part of that initiative. We look forward to further work scaling out and scaling up, not only in Malawi and Tanzania, but other countries in Sub-Saharan Africa as well. Thanks, Dr. Stan Kutcher.